hello everyone welcome back to the channel in today's video we are discussing about some of the most frequently asked real world interview questions about CICD this is part one of the series so stay tuned for more such questions that will help you crack your next DevOps interview so let's get started with our first question before we start with our question and answer, let me just give you a one liner for what is CI and CD. CI is continuous integration, which means it automatically integrates and test codes changes frequently to catch issues early. CD is continuous deployment or delivery, delivers tested code to staging or production environment automatically with or without approval let's start with our question number one this one's about optimizing a ci pipeline here's your question what are the key benefits of optimizing a continuous integration pipeline here's how you would answer optimizing a ci pipeline enhances development efficiency by reducing build times ensuring faster feedback loops improving code quality through automated testing and streamlining the release process let's go with our next question related to bottlenecks in ci pipeline and this is what the interviewer can ask you how would you identify bottlenecks in ci pipeline and this is how you can answer to identify bottleneck in CI pipeline. I usually start by checking which stages are taking the most time build test or deployment. Then I look at the logs for any repeated failures or delays. And I also use tools like Jenkins or GitLab, which also gives insight metrics that helps us pinpoint slow and problematic steps. Okay, moving on to the next one about reducing build times and the interviewer asks you Can you discuss strategies for reducing build times in a CI pipeline? Here's how you can answer to reduce build times in CI pipeline. I usually focus on few key strategies number one is Cache dependencies so they don't download every time. Number two is use parallel steps to run tests or builds at the same time. Number three is build only what's changed using incremental builds. Number four is to optimize the Docker images for smaller images, which equals faster builds. Number five is, and if possible, split long test suits into smaller jobs and run them in parallel. Okay, moving on to the next one is about optimization and the interviewer asks you what role does automation play in CI pipeline optimization? Here's how you can answer automation plays a huge role in optimizing a CI pipeline. It removes manual steps. So things like building, testing, deploying happens faster and more consistently. I usually automate things like code, linting, test execution, and even environment setup. This not only saves time, but also reduces human errors and makes the pipeline more reliable overall. Moving on to the next question is about reliability. This is what the interviewer asks you. How would you ensure the reliability of automated tests in CI pipeline? This is what you can answer. I can ensure the reliability of automated tests by regularly reviewing and updating test cases, maintaining a robust test environment, incorporating proper error handling mechanisms and monitoring test results for false positives and negatives. Thanks for watching part one of the CICD real world interview question series. If you found this helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe and stay tuned for part two.